you guys, Coach Andrew again, here for another workout. Uh, we got our cans again, so if you have some cans around the house or if you have dumbbells that you can lift, just make sure it's something that you can hold firmly and that you are able to lift. That gives you a little bit of trouble, but nothing that you can't lift. You just want to push yourself. So we're going to do tricep extensions, rows, squat press, and then we're going to drop the cans and then we're going to do arm leg extensions so arm slash leg extensions so first for the tricep extensions what we're going to do is you're going to put the can straight over your head like this okay and then you're going to bend back so the can should almost end up behind your head so straight up bend back straight up bend back so that's what it should look like okay we're going to do 15 of those ready one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and 15. Good job. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. All right. Next, we're going to do rows. So for rows, we're going to bend over at the back. Okay. So if I was doing it this way, bend over at the back. And then all you're going to do is with your cans, you're going to come straight up to your body. So it's almost like tucking your arms in. So the cans end up right up on your chest. So you bring them back down, bring them back up. So see my arms are nice and bent. That's the movement. Okay. We're going to do 15 of those, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, and 15. All right, good job, shake them out, shake them out, shake them out. All right, next one we're gonna do is squat press. So I know we've done squats before. So remember when we're doing squats, we wanna make sure our feet shoulder length apart, and then when we squat down, so instead of bending at the back like we just did, we wanna keep our back straight, okay? And then with this one, it's gonna be a squat press. So what we're gonna do is, with our cans, we squat, and then when we come back up, we go all the way up with the cans. Okay, so that's one forward. So once again, it'll look like this. Squat, and then you press all the way up with the cans. All right, let's do 15, ready? Go. One, so we squat again, press up, two, Squat again, press up, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Last one. And 15. Good job. Check it out. Check it out. All right. Now I'm going to put the cans down. We don't need those anymore. What we're going to do now is the arm slash leg extension. So we're going to get down. On our knees, if you have a mat, that would be great. Or doing it something on like carpet or something like that. Better than hardwood. But the way this is going to work is, so if I take my left arm, I'm going to extend my right leg. So it just goes opposite, right? And then you'll come back down. Now I'm going to extend my right arm and extend my left leg. 
Okay? So for these, we'll do 10, five on each side. All right, we're ready? So I'm going to start with my left arm and my right leg. Ready? Go. And just hold it there for a second. Then bring it back down. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one. Ten. Good job. So it's all those workouts that we did. Triceps, obviously. Those are strengthening these muscles right here. Triceps. The rows are more for your chest and your biceps. Okay? Squats are obviously legs first. And then when you come up, so it's your arms and your chest also. And then the arm leg extension, let me just say about that. That's more for your core. Okay? All right, that was a workout.